Sheffield's Golden Route is a critical component of the Urban Regeneration Pollock Master Plan, which the government developed in response to various urban issues arising from the city's development. It is a crucial edge along the northernmost east-west axis of Sheffield's University District and consists of a series of passages and nodes. Waterways have shaped Sheffield's development over the centuries, and its history has been built up by steel. Concerning Sheffield's history, the urban regeneration policy embeds water features, steel, and heavy metal into the Golden Route. The Golden Route begins in Sheaf Square, in front of the railway station. The 81-meter long, the cutting edge, greets you as you exit Sheffield Station. Water falls down the curved sculpture, causing it to shine. Next is Howard Street, a concrete street that leads to a terraced green area with a stepped slope that is aesthetically pleasing and makes it easier to drain in the rain. Sheffield's Tudor Square is home to the Crucible Theatre and is therefore considered Sheffield's CU. Ultural Heart. The square is dotted with circular stone flower beds with seats set into them, and these raised planting ponds provide a place to plant trees, display flowers and grasses, and sit or lie down to eat, sunbathe and chat. The Winter Garden is an exhibition hall for ornamental and scientific plants and is the largest urban greenhouse in Europe. The building is 70 meters long and 22 meters high and houses more than 2,500 plants worldwide, providing shelter from the rain, snow, and high winds. At the same time, the water features add a dynamic element to the otherwise static botanical gardens. In addition, a fan system on the greenhouse's roof provides a comfortable balance of air movement. Sheffield's steel culture is again expressed in the nine spherical water sculptures in Millennium Square called Rain. Stainless steel and water rings are similar to the blade sculptures at the railway station. The interaction of metal and water causes the water sculptures to sparkle in the sunlight. The water architecture in Millennium Square also has a low sound level. It attracts more attention, resulting in effective masking of attention. Furthermore, the water structure drives traffic to the nearby floor-to-ceiling cafes, and the bright light allows those sitting here to better enjoy the sunlight. The entrance to the Peace Garden is landscaped with a waterfall over the site and the adjacent road. The adjoining wall surrounds the sunken garden, creating an inward and downward concave topography where the sound of falling water dramatically reduces the noise from the road. Around the edge of the extensive lawns surrounding the fountain flows a Taudi stream. Human-scale water features such as dry jets, streams, small pools, and water films are used several times in the environmental route project. This attracts people of all ages.
Barker's Pool is a permanent pedestrian zone in the center of Sheffield that is close to motorized T. Raffic. At its very center is a 90 feet high war memorial. To the north of the square are two chap fountains installed outside Sheffield City Hall, where the pleasant sound of water gushing from the fountains refreshes the senses and attracts many passers-by. The final location is Devonshire Green. The streamlined edge design directs the visual line and creates a relaxed and free atmosphere in the grass amphitheater. The drainage system also prevents the formation of standing water on the grass. Raised planting ponds provide additional seating benches and are planted with drought-tolerant plants to bring color to the space all year round.